Oh shit, it's Hi guys, so in today's video, I'll be talking about my top five favorite cruelty-free brands. Or you could just go behind me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so it's going to be a really chill video. As you can see, I'm just in a sweatshirt, no makeup, because I'm staying home all day today. So, yeah, and I've been wanting to film this video for a long time now. So, um, the five brands I'll be talking about, they're all high-end brands that are sold at Sephora. If you'd like me to do um, another t video, another video like this by including drugstore brands let me know down below so yeah let's just get started so first i have and this is not in any order i love all the five brands pretty much equally so it's not um in order of ranking of likability so yeah so first i'm just going to talk about nars i adore nars it's just packaging is so beautiful the quality of the products are beautiful and I haven't tried too many NARS products, but the ones I've tried, I have really liked. So, and I'm going to also mention my favorite product from each of these brands. So, my first favorite from NARS, my favorite from NARS is the NARS Laguna Bronzer. You guys know this, like, look, it's like half finished. And this is my all-time favorite bronzer. It's just the perfect shade. It's matte. It replicates um, the shade of a shadow really nicely. And I just... It has a mirror. I just adore this bronzer and it lasts a really long time and I'm definitely going to be repurchasing this. Repurchasing this. So yeah, definitely try out NARS Laguna Bronzer. I do like this better than the Anastasia Contour Kit. <clears throat> I just find it um, blends in. It's a lot more blendable than the Anastasia Contour Shades. So second, I have Becca Cosmetics. Of course, Becca is just so famous for his highlighters and Becca highlighters are my favorite highlighters in the cosmetics industry. Um, and my favorite highlighter is of course Champagne Pop. I always talk about the same products because I just absolutely love this these products. It's just so shimmery, so intense, just, just makes your face look poppin'. And yeah, I cannot live without highlight. I think I, 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 I would like to say that I'm known for my highlight, like, um, like the people who know me and stuff. So yeah, I always wear highlight and I just love champagne pop. I think it suits my skin tone so nicely and I think it would, it suits any skin tone nicely as well. So yeah, definitely try a Becca highlighter. Thirdly, I love Bare Minerals and my favorite product from Bare Minerals are their eyeshadows. I have the Regal Wardrobe Palette here. Excuse me, and I'm just so impressed with the pigment, the pigmentation of the shadows, um, especially the shimmery ones. Like cognac over here is my favorite. It's so highly pigmented, like it's crazy. I definitely want to buy a Bare Minerals, um, another eyeshadow palette from Bare, Mineral, Bare Minerals. Um, I haven't tried any of the face products. I don't think so, but I know they're more known for their mineral veil products but i really do love the eyeshadows and i definitely want to buy some more so yeah definitely check out their eyeshadows because i feel um bare minerals is really underrated for its shadows but they're so nice so um for my fourth brand i have anastasia beverly hills of course anastasia is known for its eyebrows eyebrow products but i've actually never tried any of its eyebrow products besides the tinted eyebrow gel which i love but my favorite product is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Concealer. Mine is in 1.5. As you can see, it's like three quarters done. This concealer is just high coverage, really creamy, really blendable, really covers your dark circles very well. And just, it's such a great shade as well. Um, and I prefer cream, like concealers, instead of liquid because um, they have better coverage. And this is just amazing. I really recommend um, this concealer. And I haven't seen many people on YouTube talk about it. And also, I just want to quickly mention the Anastasia Eyebrow Brush. I have a small one. I think this is in number 12 or 23. Because they have a short version and a bigger version. And I was going to... I wanted to buy the bigger version, the longer brush. But they didn't have it. They just had this one. But I think Anastasia Eyebrow Brushes are the best eyebrow brushes Ever that I've tried and I highly highly recommend them and I recommend cleaning this spoolie too mine's really dirty but just clean it with like a makeup wipe and yeah because the brush is just really thin <coughs> oh excuse me I have a really dry throat at the moment but as I was saying um, the brush is just really 
thin, which is great for being really precise and defining the shape and the angle is really sharp as well. And I just love this brush. And lastly, my favorite, um, what? My favorite um, makeup brand, wow, is um, Too Faced. I love Too Faced Cosmetics. I, I love the Semi Sweet Palette. Um, and I love their Too Faced Chocolate Soleil bronzer, but my all-time favorite product from Too Faced is their Better Than Sex Mascara. I do not have one with me. I had a, um, sample size, and I adore that one, and I plan on buying a new one soon, but the Better Than Sex Mascara is also my favorite mascara, like, ever. So these were all my favorite cruelty-free brands at Sephora. Let me know your favorite cruelty-free brands and your favorite products as well. I'd love to know and try out new makeup down below. Thank you so much for watching. My social media is always linked down below and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.